you've got to get up here and speak to all your fans and your loved ones about a spectacular, incredible week the two of you have had. Yeah. Uh, buenos dias. Um, <laughs> yes. Um, hello, everyone. And first of all, I want to thank everyone for coming here today and supporting both teams watching our final. It has been an incredible atmosphere. And um, we are very thankful that the stadium was almost full today. It was, um, it was a pleasure to, you know, to play this WTA final today in Cancun. Well, um, honestly, you know, I, I want to thank my partner for playing with me and, um, you know, playing through bad times and good times. And uh, we've had our up and downs, but um, it's incredible that how we support each other. And I think that's what makes us the, the toughest uh, uh, team on the tour, one of the toughest teams on the tour. Of course, um, Ellen, uh, Nicole, um, you know, it's always great to be on the final day of the tournament. I know it, it can be very disappointing. I've been, you know, in a lot of finals through my career, and, but, um, you know, being in the final, it's a great achievement, and I want to congratulate you for your performance today and throughout the week. I think this week hasn't uh, been easy for anyone, and I want to, um, you know, thank all the players for being very patient and um, for trying our best on every single day. And um, you know, through the wind and the rain and everything, we tried to do our our best on the court, and we tried to to show you the best tennis uh, possible. And uh, yeah, I want to say a word of appreciation for all, for all the players, for all the players as well. Yes. <laughs> and of course, this uh, event would never be possible without the sponsors. It's uh, a happy, and uh, of course, City of Cancun. Thank you very much for hosting us this year. Of course, it wouldn't be possible without, um, you know, organizers. Um, of course, the tournament directors, Gus, Gustavo, um, and um, of course, everyone who helped to make this tournament happen. All the volunteers, ball kids, uh, linesmen, chair umpires, and um, everyone who was welcoming us um, every day and trying to do to do their best. Um, I think, I think yes, that's enough for me. I will uh, ask Laura to say a word, and uh, muchas gracias para todos. A little bit something has to be left for me, but some things I, I do want to repeat. Um, if I could have wished for someone to play in the finals, it would have been you guys because, you know, we just get along so well and I know we are ugly opponents and tough and I feel so, so bad for, for really, I feel really bad. I'm so happy we won, but you deserve also so much and uh, just, just great achievement. I still want to congratulate you. You're great guys. <laughs> Uh, I want to thank Vera. I mean, we had definitely some struggles this year also. We weren't always playing our best, but I think that's what, what makes us great is, is just how we stick together in the tough moments this week, but also over the whole season. And I'm just so happy for us to, to bring back another trophy after a few disappointments this year. So I'm just so happy we, we made it. I'm really proud of both of us. <laughs> And uh, I also want to repeat to thank the fans. I think it's really amazing. This week has really been tough, but you you guys were really the, uh, with us players who were like trying their best. I think you guys also really tried your best. It's unbelievable how you hung in there in the rain and the wind. Really, I have so much respect and thanks for coming out today. The weather is nice and thanks for, for giving us this great atmosphere. Amazing.
and I think this this week has been this week has been really not pretty in many aspects. The conditions were they were at times unbearable. And Vera said that the players really hung in there. But I have to say also the people that technically had other jobs to do here in the organization that helped to make us being able to play like dry the courts like 15, 20 times. Everybody, I mean, I don't know, from the supervisor to, I don't know, anyone who could be here on site and help, they all helped and they came several times. And I'm, I just want to say thank you to all the people for this hard work. And lastly, we forgot someone that's my, um, my team, my uh, two coaches, and uh, they're just a great support. I, I think uh, I'm so proud that we can, you know, do on the court what you're trying to teach us and, and kind of give a little bit back. So this is one of a big win that, that we will always uh, cherish together. So thank you for the support for hanging out with us and like through all the tough conditions this week. Thank you so much. Okay, so Chrissy, if you'll be so kind to grab that trophy for the ladies, and we'll hand it to them, and they'll have them officially hold that up. There we go. Yeah, it comes in two parts. So we'll, not part, not that part yet. So I'll have you hold it up. If you'll be up right here to the line and hold it up high and proud, ladies and gentlemen, may I present to you Vera Zavonareva and Laura Sigerman, your Hey NAK Segudos WTA Finals Cancun doubles champions. Let's hear it for Laura Siegemann, Vera Zvonareva with some beautiful words at the end of what has been a spectacular event for them. It's another big title. We've got four titles this season. They talked about the ups and downs they experienced. They started playing again in the spring of this year after Zvonareva returned to the tour and they have elevated their games at so many important moments. The U.S. Open finalists just came short of getting another major, but they are the WTA Finals doubles champions, Lindsay, and they were impressive down the stretch. Yeah, what a way to finish the year for Sigmund and Zvonareva, and also for Melikar, Martinez, and Perez. Sensational season comes to a close on the doubles side of the action. So great to see Chrissy Everett there as well. She looks amazing and so great to see her healthy. That these four ladies were the best doubles players this week, and it's Zvonareva and Sigmund who will be the champions.